Yeah, we're looking to... I guess just 1v all? Oh! Woo! Absolute... Hmm, something's fishy. Hey guys, I'm Shark Zone, and in today's video, we are doing a how to play Vladimir mid, where we'll be going over how to play the early mid and late game, how to team fight, how to carry every single one of your games. So like usual, if you enjoy, smash that like, comment, subscribe, and let's get into this laning phase where we're playing against the Kali. Yeah, this will be a juicy lane, wouldn't it? And uh, yeah, we decided to take Dark Seal instead of Durin Ring. The reason why is because we're building that into Magi's for sure. Let's just try to get a little harass harass. The reason why we're we're able to always harass and just be very confident in our ability to win trades is because our Q sustains us for so much. And we out sustain 95% of mid laners. So it's a game of Yeah, just chipping them down until they, they're low enough to back. Or you know, just just recall. Which will give us a lead either way. Ah, uh, use the E here. All right, cue that. She can poke us all we all, all she wants. We have the potions, we have the Q healing, and we just scale into the game. So literally, if we just farm, that's fine. But you know us, we like to play aggressive, no matter what stage of the game we're in. And uh, yeah, we really do want to. Uh, Oh, we missed the cannon. Dang. <laughs> the Akali Shroud. <sighs> I lost my train of thought there. But now's the time to just shove her under tower. Because the wave's pretty fat. I... I ah. Ha ha ha. I'm sorry. We're gonna literally 1v all carry later on into the game. Oh, Jaco's here. We're gonna back down with our pool, shroud away, and just sustain back up with our Q. We gotta play safe a little bit, lean towards this side of the lane because we don't know when he's gonna pop out and then wait the seven seconds. For our W to come back. Ah. Akali's getting risky. Okay, okay. Uh, Shaco's topside. Care. Now she's in a really bad spot. We're winning by 2 CS, which is pretty good. We got our phase rush in. We might be able to flat... We're gonna W, so that way she can't <laughs> dash onto us, and there's an easy kill. We're gonna go Proto Belts into Rabadon's Death Cap, a really heavy AP burst build with Medj Ice. <laughs> so, yeah, you're not gonna see us go Spirit Visage, none of that. We just want straight damage. And she's lucky this is a cannon wave, so she won't lose too much under tower. Master Yi, can you beat the Shaco? I don't know. But we're going to recall here. Oh, you might be able to. Pick up the Hextech Revolver and three potions. Plus a Vision Ward. Huge buy. And since we're playing against Shaco, we need a Deep Ward. Those those uh, close Bush Wards, they, they're not going to do anything. We're level 6. Sweet. All right, while we get the chance to, this is where he tends to queue the most, so. Getting a ward there is pretty ideal. Uh, just, uh, make sure we get the cannon there. We have a 10 CS lead. And on top of that, yeah, a level lead. So good, good stuff. Oh, shoot. I was typing to my jungler. 
We're going in aggressive here. Phase rush here. Get that back Q off. And she's low under tower while we're sustaining the full HP. There's not much we can do. Uh, she can do. And if she keeps staying. We might be able to tower dive. But we really do want to make sure she... Uh... <laughs> she uses her, uh, her W. Because that's the only thing that can save her. But then again, my W can save me also. So we're just in a really good spot. W to always damage her while we're here. And our our R finishes her off. Good stuff, good stuff. We're going to shove this in. Take a tower plating and then most likely recall. Our CS lead expands. Our level lead expands. And overall, yeah, just lead. <laughs> yeah. And then we did take the magical footwear, so we can't get boots. Actually, since this isn't a this isn't a cannon wave, we do want to shove this in. We literally could stay if we wanted to. W here. Yeah. Poke her out. We literally could stay because we're we're so ahead. This is kind of a greed stay though. But I'm all for it. Because she has no spell vamp right now. When she gets the gunblade, that's when things are gonna get a little bit difficult. But for now, things are things are you know, we're cruising. We're cruising. Oh. Oh. We needed a no oh, we try to flash her R. We try to flash her. Yeah, see, that, that's the greed stay. If we backed, we probably would have killed her if we got the Kindle gem. Okay, we're going to get the Proto Belt now. And just a potion. We don't want refillable because it's it's past the seven minute mark. It's just, uh eh. We're back in lane here. Going for a fast clear there. And we're going to see... What we can do here. If they're going to contest and so on. Just assisting our our jungler and top laner. Get the 100 gold from that. And take the Rift Herald. Nice. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, he could take the Vision Ward there. We finally get our Magical Footwear. Protobelt to Akali's Revolver. This is pretty huge. We aren't necessarily a, a good, good roamer. Not saying we can't roam, but we have no CC. And we, we don't have a lot. That's like the perfect time for her to go in. Yep. Oh, but we're too fed. <laughs> we're too fed. <laughs> Not much you could do when you're playing against a flat, uh, fed Vladimir. But yeah, you don't want to be going for like these, these full, full HP fights. Instead, what you really do want to do is uh, ship them down, ship them down, ship them down to lower HPs, right? And then, uh, yeah, use the HP advantage to win almost all of your all-ins. I don't know if we could have uh, taken first tower there, but uh, now we're going to get magic penetration boots. Start building towards Rabadon, but we don't have enough gold, so Amplifying Tome is all we could get. Oh, yeah. 87 CS to Akali's 40-something. Let's clear this. Use our Proto Belt to clear it since, yeah. Oh, my. She gave the Kai'Sa a kill. Going for a quick one-shot onto the Kai'Sa, then W pulling out. So that way they can't, well, kill me. Get that get that clone out of the way. To be honest, I just wanted the gold from it, the 25. Hee <laughs> hee. And then now we're 1v2ing mid. Which is A-OK -okay with me. Because we have W. <laughs> just in case things go 
Yeah, real downhill. Ah. Might be able to go in. Nope. No good, no good. Heal. Oh, heal from the R. Saved my life. Okay, we're recalling. Mmm. Just yikes. <laughs> yikes. I don't think I could do much. Because my R is down. And that's like my team fighting ability. I need that for team fighting. Let's place the vision ward right there. Uh, I don't know if Master Yi can win that. Can he? Ah. Uh, he can. And I'm too slow to catch up. Nice. Yeah, let's uh, clear the vision and then farm up. I don't want Malphite mid because all he's doing is taking my XP. I need my solo XP. Never mind, I lied. Senna's always mid. The Cena's always mid. It actually tilts me. I'll cue you for the sustain. It's a game. It's a game of farm right now. Once we build two or three items, that's when we can literally start one-shotting marksmen's and all that. Oh, I, I accidentally queued a cannon. Use our protobelt to gap close and then get our fully charged Q. Careful, Malphite. Might be able to RQ. Yeah, they know. RQ all in. This could be really good. Oh, the ignite! Killer. Oh, but I'm killer too. Ah, oh, that ignite. Ignite or grievous wounds is Vladimir's counter. So you gotta be uh, very wary of that. Hee hee. Hee hee, Akali. Don't ever test the Vladimir like that. Just stop. <laughs> Just stop, man. The Shaco is bot. Uh, we might be able to literally... All in him. <laughs> we got damage. For sure. Alright. I'm gonna have to tank some of that, but... Sustain it all back up with Q. And then, next recall, we can get our Rabidon's Death Cap, which will put us in a very, very good spot. And, yeah, we'll get that before Drag is up, so. That's going to be A-OK. -okay. Never mind. Is my team going to int that? Is my team going to hit that? <laughs> I think they are. All right, let's get our Rabadon's Death Cap. Next, we're going to get uh, Magi's, though. Yep, my team's going to hit that. Yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Uh, 370 AP. No, not too bad. Not too bad. Level 12 to level 10 Akali. Ah, we need uh, something to movement speed our way there. And our E just starts one-shotting waves now. Uh, they're low, but they can just run away. We have no hop like Fizz or anything like that. Let's just start cruising. Yep. W forward. I know which one you are. Just stop. Just cruise through. Team is taking drag. Okay. Okay. And then we can collect the side side wave really quick. Now we're at full HP. What can they do now? A Akali's there? We could just get in her face. If she shrouds. Our E.
the reason why we w'd there was to give a give our r enough time to kick in and then sustain us so just something to note your w when you use it is an essential in these team fights to win or whenever you're you know 1v2ing 1v3ing because that that will happen a lot but you kind of are playing like an assassin mid game where your goal is to just get to their back line and then disrupt them hopefully you know one shot bursting them last item uh or uh fourth item i don't know i am i really am not sure <laughs> what to get uh do they have a lot of healing they got the akali and the senna so we will opt for that morelos for sure now we got two people mid get him that's gonna gap close us close enough <laughs> To kill the Shaco. Shaco's just not having it this game. Cue that. We got Malphite mid. Uh, I'm just going to cue the Orin. Because I'm just trying to get my passive up. Ah. Uh -huh. Or my. You know when the when the Q gets fully charged. Cue that. And now. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> I mean, as long as they don't have too, too much uh, magic resist, we could just start one-shotting them. Hey, take that tower, though. Take that tower. Oh, okay. Malphite's tanking. Very, very good. Very, very good. Oh. Legendary still. Oh, Akali actually won that. Q heal. So that way I don't die. And I died from using E because that takes a percentage of my HP. Pathetic. Let's get our grievous wounds. We're headed back mid. Uh, we got a follow on Twitch, Pog. But, uh, yeah, we're looking to... I guess just 1v all. Oh, woo! Absolute heat. <laughs> Absolute heat. Our phase rush can't kick him kick in again, so we can't gap close to the Orin, especially because our proto belt's down, but uh You see the power. You see the power of Vladimir mid game after you get a couple of items. It's pretty killer. And when you're on the enemy team, it's going to feel like there's no counterplay. Mm, she saw me. Really? No! I missed! I missed! But I guess our last item is going to be Void Staff. Mm, no more mistakes about to be made. Right? Where's our phase rush at? Orin's got so much magic resist. But we're just going to use our stick potential. What a joke. What a joke Orin is. Guys, Riot Games, nerf his base stats, please. Nerf his stats. Again. He needs more nerfs. No, I'm just kidding. I need Void Staff. <laughs> hey, if I get Void Staff, it's going to be the end for him. Let's get... What is this? The War Mogs. Absolutely killer. We still obviously win. I mean... We're Vladimir. He's probably stalling. So that way his teammates come. Yeah, if I were to guess. Oh, can't 1v all. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. I need my void. I literally just need my void staff. Well, let's get it. Come on. Rallies, yeah, definitely. Situational item. Like how they always run away from us. Rallies may actually be good. Instead of the Magi's, but. Yeah, actually. Rallies instead of Magi's. I'm thinking about it. The Magi's will sure give us more damage, but overall. Is he gap closing towards me? 
What type of clown stuff is this? Actual jester. What type of clown stuff is this? You guys really think? Your guy's ego this big? Okay, my ego's that big. Why did I go in like that? <laughs> Alright, you know what we're doing now? We're just going to the side side lane. Yeah, we're not grouping mid. Team can do whatever. We're, we're uh... You're split pushing. Where we could find success. Catching them in a 1v1 situation. Or they can bring all of them while my team takes Baron. That's how we're going to win this. And start stacking up our Magi's while we're at it. And if the team doesn't start... Stop clowning. They're just clowning around. Come on, Master Yi. Pop that R. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Woo. Woo. You guys are just... You guys are silly. Too much. It is possible for me to 1v all them. Nah, 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 nah. We got, they got two mid. Come on, Elixir Autos. We got Void Staff. How does it feel now? How does it feel now? Now that we got Void Staff. Not so tanky, huh? Alright. It's gonna heal me. On top of that. And I gotta, I gotta cue someone. All right, we're going to cue that minion there. That's good. Oh, I actually landed the R. But yeah, we're not going to forfeit. Let me heal a little bit. He literally just Warmog healed that back. Like what? And here we are. The Vladimir late game. Where I feel Rallies is kind of feeling like an essential this game, but we went for that full damage. Which isn't even bad. Let's start sieging. I could literally just one-shot them. I could just one-shot them. Anyone but the Orin is a squishy target in this game. W that fat Q off there and I could just sustain slowly but surely uh, they don't win these fights come on Akali go in on the ash they're scared of my Q Ooh. Always looking for the back line. You see? That's how you play these fights. You just look for the back line. Pop. Triple kill. Uh, I can't get my quadra. No quadra in sight. Is that the game? Yes. But do we want to really end? I, that, that literally could have been the game. But, but um, no, I want to show you more of how to play Vladimir. So... Yeah, we're going to pick up our allies here. And the elixir. To put us at 1,000 AP. Baron's up. Hey, we're slow, but we do damage, right? We're slow and we do damage. And the stick potential is there because of our... Whatchamacall... Yeah, our... Uh, Q and E. Phase rush. Stick potential is there. <sighs> Guys, take Baron. I'll go bot. Ward has no TP. He can't make it there on time. Do that. They have to send everyone bot. <laughs> no joke. Everyone bot or else they stand no chance. Take the Baron. It's a, it's a wait game. Oh, Kais is there. I see other people are there. Oh. Of 
Proto belt. No, no, I failed. I failed my team. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <sighs> I probably even could have outplayed that. All right, we're just getting Leandris. Nah, nah, nah. How much does the match ice give for AP? Yeah, it's still a lot. 140? Oof. Still big damage. Nah. Leandris is probably the better choice out of the two. Now thinking about it. Because it's just going to overall provide more damage in the longer fights. Can you do it? Don't misplay it. You guys are misplaying it, aren't you? You guys are misplaying this fight. Get the Kaisa. Can they fight without me? Wait, wait, wait for the one and only to come in. Uh, Shaco's still dead. I mean, he doesn't really count as a champion at this point. But still, wait for the one and only Vladimir to come in. I'm the team's carry. And we have Baron minions still? Oof. GG's. Actually, you, you better bring yourself over here. No joke. Bring oh, hoo -hoo! one shot. No, it's done. You're done, though. See? Ludens was the choice. It was the best choice. Now you see the damage. You just scale. Scale super hard mid to late game and carry from just one-shotting these squishies. And it feels like there's no counterplay in their eyes. Yeah, we're going to do one more fight here. Don't pull her in. Wait a minute. <laughs> okay, let's end the game. Ah, <laughs> uh, they're funny. Like always, if you enjoyed, found it helpful, like, comment, subscribe. I'm out.